Mahoney County Commissioners say the numbers don't tell the whole story. Days after a newspaper article was published saying 760 county workers got pay raises last year, commissioners and department heads fired back with a few numbers of their own. 27 First News reporter Dan Martin has our story. Board of Commissioners Chairman David Ditzler says there were 761 pay adjustment allocations last year in Mahoning County. Just don't call them all raises. To categorize 760 raises when, you know, 336 of them are not related to the general fund, 207 of them are the sheriff's department coming off of concessions and going back to 2008 wages, how can that be construed as an increase? The Mahoning County Solid Waste Management District is funded by landfill disposal fees, not the general fund. Director Lou Vega saw his salary increase from $45,000 to a little more than $72,000 in 2013. He was promoted and took on more work when two other positions were eliminated. It's not the small increase for the redistribution of the work, but it's the savings of $120,000. I think that's the real story, if you ask me. Commissioners cut 289 positions and saved $7.5 million in payroll from 2009 to 2013, but say they still need voters to approve a half-cent sales tax renewal at the polls in May to avoid layoffs. It's hurting the chances of that tax getting renewed, and we all know how that, that budget shortfall will get balanced. It'll get balanced on the backs of the Mahoning County Sheriff's Office. You cannot live on a half a cent and expect your county services to be the best that you want them to be. Commissioners say they're trying to be more transparent in letting the public know how each employee is compensated and the reasons for any increase in salary. Dan Martin, WKBN 27 First News.